Today, we have had bus, the, the bus routes will be carved out. So there'll be bus drivers already driving today's buses on those routes that will be affected. So the question is not so much more. Of course, uh, with more, more services, more buses, you will, you will need more drivers. But more pertinent is how then do you say this operator A, especially when operator B comes in, uh, move these same people who are affected by the bus route over to the new operators? It's a transition problem that we have to solve. And that is not easy because you are moving employment from operator A to another operator B, even if the operator is new. And that experience has, that has been ported over to a new operator. These are the issues that we have to deal with. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I think that uh, one way to address that issue is that uh, we, we may include uh, the driver performance as a part of the KPI. Then, the, then, then bus company has to provide them a proper, the proper right. training. Yeah, but so well, when we are doing this, I feel that uh, uh, government uh, should also be more careful in providing uh, a healthier operating environment to the bus captains. Uh, of course, we have the bus way, bus lanes. Uh, when bus captains drive the bus on the bus lanes, it's comparatively easier than driving on an ordinary route. Yeah. So how to further ensure the bus priority so they can uh, operate the bus in the less hassle environment? I think that's very critical. So that uh, at the end, uh, we all can receive the benefit. Yeah, and, and that's good for everyone as well, you know. So, uh, well, uh, Bunhon, just very quickly, if you could have one, one wish you would like to see from uh, the bus drivers here, just very quickly, what do you think yeah. that would be? Um, I, I think there's a concern with uh, KPI driven um, to, to better the service is that um, the bus driver will get impatient, you know, they have time, timing to meet, to reach on time. They may not have this um, patient, you know, to take mm -hmm. care of the disabled, get getting down, you know, help to carry them. That okay. might cause them, you know, to uh, get penalized for the KPI, KPI yeah, for right. example. Because it's just how, well, okay, how, okay. How do you uh, strike the balance? There is another way of doing it because this is what happened in Seoul. Uh, actually, the, when we evaluate the bus driver's performances, uh, how he greet the passenger and whether he smiles or not is also part of the, mm. uh, the point as well. So the kind of one uh, common joke is that uh, the worth of the bus driver's smile is about $6 million. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's partly true. I mean, if you get the bus and he says hello, you feel better already. The overall experience okay, changes, yeah. right? <laughs>